Hi, I'm Sega Lady and welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is me going through a highlights video of the second of 100 of the 100 times 2 bundle of Pokemon cards I bought off eBay. Um, the reason why I'm making these videos is so you, as a viewer, will see what cards I bought as a bundle off eBay and see what the sellers are sending out to the buyers. So, um, I've gone through um, videos um, doing the unboxing, gone through the first 100, did a highlights video, I've gone through the second 100 and now this is the highlights video. There is a couple of cards I need to add on because I've run out of time, the YouTube videos can only be about 15 minutes. So I'm just going to run through the last few of the cards from the previous video. Um, please leave comments below because it informs me about these Pokemon cards a bit more because I'm still learning about them and importantly the trading card pokemon community players please like and subscribe if you want to see more of these videos um okay so let's start on those last couple of cards so we have a trainer card which is really exciting um it's a nightly garbage run and it's from them Ro team rockets and it's a rocket secret machine in brackets it is a um, uncommon card, but importantly, I'm going to bring up to the camera, it is a first edition card. Now, these cards are very sought after. I can confirm that the card is in very good condition. There is a, a bit of whiting on the bottom, but hardly anything. Um, but it is a really card to have in my collection. Um, probably will go for, a, um, a, say, about, about three or four pounds on eBay. Could be a lot more, but it's a sought after card. So that's good for the highlights at the end. Mm -hmm. I have a um, common Whimser card. It's a basic and it is a normal energy card that's required. It is next a Drowsy. Um, this is in really good condition from one of the early sets. Um, requires Psychic Energy, basic Pokemon and it is common. This is one of the fake cards I was getting and mentioned in the previous videos. Um, so this bundle has contained some fake cards. Um, Fire Energy, um, it is a Magra Morta, um, Stage 1 Evolution, and it is a rare card, but unfortunately it is fake. You can just tell by feeling about them. I will go into that into detail. Now this is interesting. Please leave comments. I haven't seen any of these cards like this before. This requires either energy, I think. Or combination of energy. It requires fairy and water energy. It's an Amarazil and it's a stage one and it is a common card. This is a Snubble. Um, it is a basic and it's fairy energy that's required and it is a common card. And then this is in Azrael, a normal energy basic Pokemon and it is a uncommon card. Okay, so that was the last of the couple of cards that I hadn't showed from the previous videos. So now I'm going to go into the highlights. So, um, and this is going to be the highs and lows of the second 100 of that bundle of the best cards that we've had and some of the worst cards that we had. Okay, so I um, would like to start um, the Team Rocket cards. I think they have to be mentioned. So there's obviously two types of decks of Team Rocket, so I'm going to bring in the other one to show that this had the first edition on it, and um, the tra um, the trainer card, and this one is just a normal Pokemon from the Team Rocket. The deck symbol is in the corner of the Pokemon on the right hand side, where on the other one it's in the bottom right hand corner. Um, I think these are very sought after cards, or would be, so I'm really happy that I've got these cards to add to my collection. The exciting Holo Hitmachan. Can't believe I got this card. Um, it is um, obviously in played condition because it scratches. It's um, actually started to reveal some shininess. I can confirm it is a real card. I know that these are sought after on eBay in really good condition. I've had a look. It would have sold for about £250. Uh, I'm going to add it to my collection. and I wouldn't want to sell it um, because I want to start collecting them. But it, of course it's got scratches on it so it would probably go for a lot less. But really excited I've got this from my collection. Um, got issue with duplicates. Um, 
again in this um, set 100 um lots of duplicate cards comparing the uncommon cards to a deck so um yeah problem with that this is a size of sperling trainer card um in total i've had four out of the 200 um really good um cards um from the early deck of the um trainer cards um but unfortunately when you turn it around, I've mentioned this on the other highlights video, the first 100, we're having problems with writing on the back. I'm just going to bring it up to the camera. You can see that there's some writing in the Pokeball of a D, um, written in pen. And fortunately, that instantly decreases the value of both these cards. So we were probably worth um, a couple of pounds because they are from the earlier decks. And um, this one has ink pen on it, like felted pen. Um, they were not going to be worth much, not at all now. So that is a low side. So it's an upside when you get a really good con condition card like that. And then unfortunately, pen just takes the value just to plummeting down. But these won't be going in my collection anyway. I've actually found these are duplicates, which is a good thing. Um, but um, if they were going in my collection, I would leave them out because they got um, writing on them. Um, we've got the Game Boy um, cards that appeared. Um, so I've done some research um, on these e-symbol um, deck cards. This would have used a Game Boy Reader, a Game Boy Advance game, to actually read the Pokemon in. And what was really exciting is we did manage to pull a Pikachu card from that deck. Really good, you guys. Really like that. So um, it is um, in um, play condition. It's not a card to get valued um, by PSA or anything like that because it's got a lot of white edges on it. But I can confirm it is a real card. So really good they got that card. Really exciting. We got the um, rare, um, it's not a holo or reverse holo, of the Pidget from the Jungle card. Really excited that we got this card. Really love it. It's in really good condition as well. Um, not much whiting on there. So this is a really good card um, to have in my collection. Really excited that we got that, you guys. Another downside. Um, We've got bends in cards. We've got creases going right across here. So what would have been a really good fossil um, side deck card? We've got a lovely crease. It's real, um, but it, um, it's going to go in my collection, obviously. If I ever get a double, um, this card will probably get replaced out um, and then used to play in the actual community of, with po actual Pokemon players. And I do hope to play the game with the, the spare cards I have or duplicates. So... But yeah, you're going to get creases. That's um, one thing about buying second-hand cards on eBay. Got this um, jungle card. Um, would have been um, a good one for my collection. And fortunately, it's got... Um, I'm going to bring it up to the camera the best I can. It's got like these little tears that's been taken out of the actual um, Pokemon card. Um, it is an actual real one because the black is starting to come through onto the sides. Um, so I have double-checked that, but it's not great. So that's another downside about buying Pokemon cards on eBay has been used. Mentioned already, we've got fake cards. I'm going to try and bring one up here. So this is a fake card. Um, you can tell just by the way it feels. The way it bends, you know, it's not great. It doesn't feel like a normal card. So um, I have mentioned in the previous videos, I managed to contact the um, seller that sold me those. I managed to get like a basic refund. So where I paid £13 in total, I had my postage back. Um, because I've had a really good card. I thought that was fair, in all honesty. So that's another downside. We did have a rare um, trainer card, um, a devolution spray from one of the early sets as well. Um, so that was really exciting to get. So, you, you, you know, there is a chance of getting some really good early uh, cards that were produced. I see this is like back in 1999. So... And comparing how old it is when you think about it, it's in good condition. We have got some whiting on here, um, but it's still good for my collection. So we've got the a dark electrode from the Team Rocket. Love it. And obviously we have the jungle version just to show you the difference in those. I know the Rocket Team Rocket cards are sought after, so um, we have pulled a few of those. I will mention... 
that um, I have had lots of cards. Um, this is um, very this is one. I'm going to try and bring up to the corner. Is this um, deck symbol in the bottom right hand corner? We had the most cards in total from the XY series. Um, a lot of cards actually. And we had a lot from the very early edition deck as well. So the deck that actually would have contained um, this Bill Trainer card. So we've had loads of that. So that's the main three decks I've had cards out of. In total, I've had 32 different deck cards from that 200 card bundle. And also as well, um, there's some really cool cards that require dual energy. Quite like that anyway. But you can play um, normal energy cards. So it's a very similar thing. So I'm questioning that. So I hope you enjoyed um, these videos of me going through a 100 times two Pokemon cards bundle I bought off eBay. I hope you actually got some insight of um, what has been sent out to me as a buyer um, from the actual eBay site. You know, you can't go wrong with the two special cards that we actually pulled, which um, I believe are these two in total. I actually would say three, actually. We're going to give it a top three. So in third place, we've got this Pikachu card. In second place, we've got the Pidgeot. And in first place, we've got the, the Holo Hitmachan. I had two Holos um, from the actual bundle. So um, if you um, want to see more of these videos, I do plan to buy another bundle of Pokemon cards. Please let me know on the comments below. And um, i see you again in future videos. Take care, you guys. Bye. Please like and subscribe.